To truly appreciate any story, you must start at the beginning. Since 1947, the Air Force has had a long and powerful history. The men and women who have come before you, who have stood on the same grounds you do now. Throughout both world wars, the Berlin Airlift, Korea, Vietnam, and to the present, each generation birthing their own stories and legacies. While popular stories always surround those ace pilots who took to the skies in fighter planes to harass the enemy, most often forget about the less glamorous, yet equally heroic men and women of maintenance who work day and night on our aircraft, in heat, rain or snow, performing the necessary maintenance to get these jets to take off again and again. This can be done because of people like you. You, the maintenance professional, an example of an airman who emphasizes the act of service before self. Mission control, area secure for C-17. Picks are clean. Roger, after one. You're cleared off. We'll take it from here. Mission control. Reach nine and one minute out. Request drop quick. Reach nine. Credit, however, can't be given to only flight line maintainers. Those working behind the scenes in support deserve plenty of credit as well. Though not exactly exciting, paperwork is absolutely essential to running an operation. Whether it's ensuring tool serviceability, scheduling, or any of the other hundreds of tasks, it takes a great deal of focus and determination to accomplish any mission. Most people don't appreciate this thankless yet extraordinarily necessary job. Pilots, however, definitely do know the importance of maintenance themselves. Hey, maintainers, I'm Colonel Mark Furman, the Ops Group Commander for the 62nd I'm here with my squadron commanders, and we just wanted to say thank you for what you do. No jet leaves the tarmac without your input, and it's helping us lift 36% of Air Mobility Command's work every day, and we appreciate it. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Every time you launch a jet, you shake the heavens. Every single sortie plays an integral part in the machine that delivers life-saving supplies to the most far-flung corners of the globe. From the Middle East to South America, even Antarctica for Operation Deep Freeze. This is the mission that never ends. But what does this mean? What comes with this devotion to duty? Why should you care when you already know what you do? The answer is, because you are necessary and important. Because the job is thankless, the hours are long, the conditions are grueling. In short, it's about the human spirit. It's about believing that we can move mountains. It's about perseverance and the ability to look at the unknown and say, I can conquer that. It's about reminding ourselves that no matter how down we are, no matter how stressed we are, no matter how dark and conflicted the world may seem, there is a spirit inside all of us capable of spreading its wings, ready to take flight. And yet, despite all of this, you chose to do the job. You chose to be a piece of something greater than yourself.
you chose to play the role of a hero, a part you auditioned for by raising your right hand, and being part of the less than one percent that chooses to serve. No matter your reasoning for this, your decision deserves applause. Because no matter where we go, every boat turned, every engine that's repaired, every piece of paperwork filed is absolutely necessary to the success of the world's greatest air force. You are still, despite everything, the sword and shield of this country. So thank you, Maintainers, and keep up the good work.